Man, what's going on, y'all? The fish tracker here. And man, I'm out here at Ballot Park. And I'm gonna come out here and uh, in, the, in the beginning, once I get to the bank, I ain't gonna be doing much talking because I gotta get set up how I need to get set up. But uh, I'm gonna be catfishing. Trying to see if the catfish bite. And uh, I'm still gonna be working with that steel shed, y'all. So y'all just give me a second before I start socializing. Let me get set up. Hopefully we have some luck today. Catch no turtles, y'all. Catch us old golly whopper of a catfish. That's what we're really hoping for. And hopefully it won't take long to do so. Y'all bear with me, hold up. I probably could have threw that further. Y'all, it's been a long time since I've uh, since I've used my uh, my catfish pole. Set that down right there. Yeah. I'm gonna throw this steel shadow in. crazy out here. But you gotta watch these ducks. They always wanna try to swim right where you're throwing it. Maybe we'll get hung up on us a nice catfish out here. It's been a minute since I've catfished out here, but I, I know one thing, they, they in here. I 
definitely if you catch one, it's, it's gonna be one of size. Hopefully. Try. Like I've been saying in my last few videos, just never know. A leaf. For a second, I thought I had hit hooks on. But no patience is a, a virtue, also. That definitely comes with fishing. spot. season hit though y'all right here in this spot right here them crop is moving in right here I keep an eye on that pole make sure I ain't getting a bite Give me a second, I'm finna move, get this stuff together, and I'm gonna move. And man, we're gonna see what happened in another spot. Alright. 
All right, y'all, I'm back. I moved around by the drain pipes. And hey, man, I'm gonna just cast out here. Let's see what happened. spray it could attract something sooner spray that liver with that old garlic spray Bass, brim, crappie. What's the, what's the best size for you over here? <clears throat> well, so we got some holes in somewhere around. Yeah, uh, I know usually the bass and stuff be around on this side, mm -hmm. but you can really catch them all around. You just have to come out here and try, man. fish in here. They in here. This is where I hook. That big old cart. You can go to one of my videos. And uh, I think I put it, I put on hook, uh, lost a big carp or hooked a big carp and lost it. And that's exactly what happened. I hooked a big old giant carp and then Joker got off. I lost it.
ายนี้Going somewhere else or calling it a day. I really can't move around like I want to. touched it at all. I've been watching it and looking at it the whole time. Nope. Nothing. I can tell by the way it looks. here at this part but I may go somewhere I think I'm gonna go somewhere else and try so until the next location I'm gonna be right back with y'all all right all right y'all I'm back location and uh this right here i'm uh downtown east tupelo that's where i'm from and man it's a little small little pond up here downtown it's a little small park basically uh I really don't even know if it's a specific name for this little park. But what I do know is 
It is some fish in here. I do know that. I don't know whether they're gonna bite or not, but I do know it is some fish in here. As far as the steel shed, now I don't know if they're gonna bite this. Extremely low in here. Extremely low. I'm throwing this little steel shed in here just to see if anything will bite it. fishing shades on and I can about see the bottom and a lot of it that you know that's just how low the water level is see two turtles right there Got something, y'all. Got something. About time. About time. Man, I got the skunk off. <laughs> got the skunk off, finally. Finally, y'all, got the skunk off. <clears throat> Took forever. But, eight something minutes into the video. Little bass. Little year. Good little specimen of a bass. But I'm gonna let him go. Put them back in there. Finally, man, got the skunk off, man. Dog gone. I thought I wasn't gonna never catch nothing. But I knew. I was tell, told y'all some fish in here, though. They in here. They in here a little bigger than that. I have caught them out of here bigger than that. But I always. You know, throw the bass back in the brim. I throw them back. Just because, you know, you keep them. I mean, it already ain't, you know, it's not a giant pond. So it, it ain't hard to catch, you know, to catch the fish out of here like that. That, now that felt good. It felt good to get the skunk off. That felt real good. On a steel shed, y'all. Caught that bass on a steel shed. Y'all better look them up and get them, get them in, your, in your collection now. Tell me. Still shed on the bank. Close in. Oh, got one, y'all. Got another one. There we go. Got another one. 
Another little small bass. Another little small bass. Now hold up now. Now I want y'all to look at this. I really don't know though. But if I ain't mistaken, I think this the same. Nah, it may be another one. Cause the other one, I hooked him in the mouth. Nah, this this another one. I finna say though. There you. Let me get him back in here. I don't think that's the same fish, y'all. That yeah, I done caught twice. I, w I wouldn't think. But I was about to say, look at here now. Because I know the other one I caught, he was real red at the top of his mouth. Y'all uh, get in the, in the comments and and uh, tell me what y'all think. But at least I got the skunk off though. Caught two of them. Probably most of like brown. Oh, got one, y'all. Got another one. Got another one on. He's a little bit better, too. Again, that joke out there. Oh, no, he around about the same size, though. It's number three for today. Number three. But I ain't gonna keep him. I'm gonna put him back. Number three for today. I'm thinking, nah, oh, there had to be a different fish. Now that I'm down here, I'm seeing uh, all on the roof of the mouth is red. Careful, y'all, not to not to get hooked. <clears throat> Even though it's a small fish, I don't want to get hooked hooked at all. There we go. I just barely put my foot on them, man. I'm not hurting the fish when I do that, when y'all see me do that. I'm not hurting the fish at all. I'm just barely put my, a little, just a tad bit of pressure on him. So he won't, uh, so he won't jump and hook me, get me hooked. I'ma show y'all how he look. He a little bit bigger, tad bit bigger. Good one. Put him back. And he gone. Alright y'all. Uh, I'm kind of glad that I did come here today. I ended up catching three of them. For a second I thought I caught the same fish twice. Still a little iffy about that. But I really don't know though. But um, as far as fishing at Ballot Park. I didn't have no luck out there. Um, on the cat fishing side. North. Uh, on the uh, steel shed but I came here downtown East Tupelo Mississippi and uh, at this little park small you know this small park at the small pond and I caught three bass so you know that's pretty good to get the skunk off but uh, man y'all keep casting while the bite's hot 
because uh, if you don't, you're going to go out there behind somebody else and they ain't going to be around. They're going to be gone. And man, happy new year's to everyone. To all my subscribers, I appreciate y'all. And to all you non-subscribers, subscribe, man. Hit that subscribe button. Hit that like. And subscribe, comment, um, and share, and all of the above. All right. Happy new year.